You said something interesting that I read about one of the things that you do when you first get a script, which is you go through the script and pick everything the character mm -hmm. says about herself and then everything in another column that someone else says about the character, and then that person becomes three-dimensional to you. Definitely. this. I feel like I'm a detective as an actor. To me, the script is everything. Every line in that script will tell me something about who I'm playing. It's like I've got to piece it together. I'm searching So how like do you organize that? I mean, what, is your script, what do your scripts look like? So I'm going through a script, and if I'm saying something, I don't understand why she's saying it. I'll just write why, and I know that I have to answer that question. Anything that's like information, you know, where someone says, Zero Dark Thirty, I was recruited out of high school. So then I underline that. She was recruited out of high school, and then I write, why, who recruited her, what was that story, and every time I go through the script, I keep adding to my notes to the side. So you're almost creating a memory bank so that when yeah. you're acting, you just have that there and you don't have to. I don't to. bring my, my script to set. You don't? If I'm carrying this script in a way, it makes me feel like I'm not the character. Right. I'm creating this person, like this witchcraft, out of nothing. She's a, sep she's a, a person I almost like I get to meet. It was so fun playing Celia Foote. I loved hanging out with her. Are you someone that also knows not only your own lines, but the other no. character's lines? No, you just know your own. You know, if someone's saying, mm, why would you do that? I memorize her subtext of what that answer is okay. in a way. Like, why does my character say this in response? And then I go, well, she says this because he just said this, and it connects to that. Oh, yeah, of course that's why I would say that. So. You know, I memorize, I memorize or I map out the inner life, but all that changes on a set depending on how someone is saying their lines to me. I make right. the character as real as possible, but if someone screams at me, I love you, or if they whisper, I love you, that's gonna change the way I'm gonna respond. So that's the exciting part for me. I mean, I would rather not know what the other character character's gonna do. Yes, I have a game plan of what, where my character would lead, but all that changes on set depending on what, what I'm um, being faced with.